NASA is getting ready to send four astronauts back into space. Sunday's scheduled launch will be a huge step in bringing space flight back to U.S. soil. Right now, the Crew Dragon capsule sits atop a Falcon 9 rocket ready for liftoff, and one of Southern California's own will be at the controls. NBC4's Jonathan Gonzalez has more. Well, if the weather holds up, tomorrow should become a red letter day for the American space program. NASA and Hawthorne based SpaceX all set to launch regular space travel from American soil since the space shuttle was retired. And one of Southern California's own will be at the controls. I'm Victor Glover, NASA astronaut and pilot for the NASA Crew 1 mission to the International Space Station. There are those who say the sky's the limit, and then there are those who say, why not higher? I've been to 64,000 feet. That's the highest up I've ever been above the ground. And so to get to a point beyond that and then be able to look down at the Earth, um, that'll be a little special moment. NASA astronaut Victor Glover is preparing for his first flight to space, piloting SpaceX's Crew Dragon on its historic first regular flight to the International Space Station. This officially marking the next era of human spaceflight from U.S. soil. I, I coached a kid who's going to the International Space Station. Those who know Victor best say he's always had his sights on the stars, but his dream started on the ground here in Southern California. He, he's going in spite of my coaching, not because of my, anything I ever said or did. <laughs> Just ask Dave Cook, who was Victor's pole vault coach at Ontario High School in the early 90s. He was just driven. He wanted to do it right and he wanted to be the best. He didn't really care about the answer. He wanted to know why it existed. And so it, there was a deeper thought there all the time. Victor obviously is setting a new school record in how high he's going. After college, Victor joined the Navy, where he excelled as a pilot. And after serving, he became a legislative fellow under Senator John McCain when he got the call from Houston that would change his life. T minus 15 seconds. A life lifted by so many and ready for liftoff thanks to three life lessons. Five, four, three. Be a good teammate. Two. Two, be a lifelong learner. One. Number one is to be gritty. G R I T T Y. Ignition. Liftoff. My overriding thought when I envision us getting to that point is don't screw up. <laughs> Jonathan Gonzalez, NBC4 News. <laughs> okay, that's always good advice for every walk of life. I don't know about you, but I can't wait till Sunday. The launch is set for Sunday afternoon, 427 our time. For more on what to know about this weekend's historic SpaceX NASA launch, head to our website, NBCLA.com. Just search SpaceX NASA launch.